everybody, Mr. Nike SB6 back again, 2013. Let's talk about 2012, 10th year anniversary for Nike SB. I was supposed to do this video last year, obviously. I am fucking late. I'm gonna get back on my vid grind now. I went to see the family for uh, the holidays. But besides that, um, I, I really wanted to do this video. They made 10th year anniversary last year, uh, 2012. It was a very big year for them in my opinion. I think they had some awesome releases. Quick Strikes, uh, the Hyper Strike release, just the quality on these sneakers I thought was great. And uh, I even think some of the GRs were really fucking killer. So with that being said, I wanted to show you guys my favorite out of the orange box, silver box, black and purple, pink, and gold box series, and blue box of course. So I will show you my favorite sneakers that I have in my collection out of those. And um, you guys let me know, please, in the comment section below what's your favorite in your collection out of those colored boxes. Um, we will start off with a brew because anything else would be uncivilized. There that goes. Um, if you guys don't have some fucking beer in your refrigerator right now, please do me a favor, go to the store, stop the video, go to the store, come back, drink a brew with me, let's do this shit, let's celebrate Nike SB anniversary the right way. Uh, this magazine released, which was Soul Collectors, issue number 41, uh, shout out to Mr. Crispy Coil, he hooked it up with this one, uh, it says Nike SB turns 10, every dunk ever, and they just give you an awesome look at all the dunks. As you can see inside but they did not put in every dunk so that is definitely a false advertisement on that fucking book because they missed a lot of sneakers I noticed but besides the point let's start off with my favorite orange box dunk high Paul Brown's my favorite and Nike SB sneaker in general just an all-around clean sneaker great color placement love it love it love it We'll work our way to Silver Box. Silver Box, you have your Bisons. This is my second favorite SB in general. A suede tongue, sucker for gum soles, you already know that. Color placement, uh, just the buttery feel of this suede. It has to be my favorite silver. Uh, a shoe I never thought I would own, honestly. Um, starting my collection off, I just, it was just one of them sneakers I felt like I was gonna have to take a hit for. And um, I got lucky. My homie Mikey Rocks123 hooked it up on this one big time and uh, blessed me with a uh, great deal on these. Expect a video on this very, very soon. I've been actually working on it, so um, you will see that soon. And that would have to be pigeons. I mean, just the madness this shoe brought. You know the fucking stories. You've seen the videos on YouTube about the whole fucking craze that went and happened with this shoe. Pigeons have to be my fucking favorite pink box that I own. And starting on, and then we're gonna work our way to the black and purple. Black and purple, you can't go wrong with Brutes. Brutes, I think, have the best fucking quality ever. I know a lot of people probably disagree with me, but Brutes made it to my fucking fave. It was either this or SBTGs, but um, Brutes is just fucking sick sneaker color placement. Everything about this sneaker is just sick. The double day swoosh, the silver swoosh on top of it. Favorite black and purple box. Gold box. I would really pick if I had it in my collection. This is about what I have, not my favorite gold box. But what I have in my collection, if I had the rations or if I had my Melbournes, which I had, I threw up on them one of those fucking nights and I actually threw them out. But if I had either one of those, it would definitely blow this one out the box. But what the dunks are my favorite that I have right now. Clean sneaker, all around awesome. I mean, just to put every fucking sneaker in one. I definitely think that with the 10th anniversary, they should have did a dunk high or a dunk mid for that matter would have been dope. Especially a nice, you know, nice way to celebrate 10 years. But they didn't do that. And blue box, of course, you guys know. The skunks, you can't go wrong with the sneaker. It just, it brought back fucking, the fucking sick concepts and fucking materials and color to fucking SB again. 
best blue box hands down and um, a lot of people slept on these shits when they came out and you know and I know you're regretting that shit right now three pairs strong on this one and I'm going for more trust me favorite blue box so these are my favorite fucking sneakers that I have in my collection color you know color wise for boxes series and um, 2012 great year 2013 coming up let's have another good year and um, looking forward to some new pickups and shit like that look forward to more videos I'm gonna be posting videos maybe I'm gonna try to get my hands on a recording at least four times five times a week so expect a lot of videos discussions reviews and just uh, different videos in general I will put I will be putting a video of my top SBs this year so stay tuned for that one and um, how about a fucking cookie guys how about a fucking cookie honestly that's a one shot cookie if you fucking bite a chips ahoy something wrong with you you got a one shot them bitches but please guys keep subscribing keep commenting Keep on looking out for more vids, and um, I'll keep bringing you this fucking nice reviews and try my best to fucking, you know, not bore you guys to fucking death with my videos. I will see you guys very soon for another video. We will cheers it. 2012, good year, gone. Let's move on to bigger and better things for 2013. Bless all you fuckers out there, and um, thank you very much for watching my vids. Salute to all of you guys. Cheers. And let's get the fuck out of here.